A lot of times in my posts, I will add something to it for a tool change position. Now, normally you would see it right here before the uh, tool change. You'd see something up here that would send it to a Z, retract, and then an XY move to a, like a safe, clear tool change position. This particular one doesn't have it here until I go to the end. When I get down at the end, the very last thing tells it to go to X10, Y10. So here's the retract. It goes T0, Z0, and then moves X10, Y10. And that's really to move the table out towards you so that it's easier to reach in and grab the part and change the part. Now, there's usually a default in here in Mastercam or sometimes in the post. But if you want to change that, basically you'd go into your parameters and you'd find the Home Position button. Now, I'm in X3 right now. But if you look in X4 or anything newer than X4, if you look in the tree, you'll find a home position. When you click on home position, you'll have an X, Y, and a Z position. That's where you want it to go when you change tools. So I'm going to make the Z zero. I'm going to make the Y three inches so it brings the table out towards me a little bit. And then X 12 inches so it moves over to the side a little bit more. Again, your numbers might be different. I'm just putting this in so we'll see something different. Now, all I did was change it for this one particular toolpath. And you may really need to change it for every one of these toolpaths. And the easy way to do that is to just select the group so all the operations are selected. Right-click on top of that toolpath group. And we've shown this to you before. Basically, you go to Edit Selected Operations, and we're going to say Edit Common Parameters. Now this allows me to change all the parameters that are the same for all of the toolpaths that I selected. All of these toolpaths have a home position, and I want that home to position to be 12 and 3 and 0 for X, Y, and Z. So we're going to OK that. I'm going to OK here. Now if I open up any one of these, go into the parameters and look at home position, I'm going to have X12, Y3, and Z0. So with all of those selected, I'm going to repost my program. Tell it to update the file. And again, if I go to the end, now we'll see that our final position moves to X12 and Y3. So you can control where you want the tool change position to be if the tool change position is being output in your program.